This is the Kremlin, a very impressive place. The word simply means fort, which it is or was. But inside there are a number of old churches, museums, uh, historic buildings which contain rooms much like the ones we were just in, but perhaps not as well redecorated. So what now for the press corps? Now we go back and listen to a briefing by U.S. officials to tell us what they meant about what was said in the press conference. It may or may not add to the sum of our knowledge. <laughs> We're leaving the room where the press conference was held and going through another room that is covered with gold leaf. The restoration of these three rooms is extraordinary and apparently was extraordinarily expensive. But this is the Kremlin that they want to show to the rest of the world. This is uh, the three salons in the Kremlin in the presidency that was renovated, I don't know, maybe a dozen years ago, at enormous cost. Uh, one of them, which we can't see, is connected to this, was all done in gold leaf. I think that's the one beyond the next room where the news conference will be held. Uh, this is nothing if not imperial, don't you think? So what are we doing here? Hanging out, We're waiting. We do a lot of waiting. They've thoughtfully provided us with water and soft drinks and pastries, which are kind of stale, but and sandwiches with mystery meat. In them. Probably been to Moscow uh, ten or twelve times, and in the Kremlin, I think on each one of those. First time I was here, uh, I think the first time I came here, I was with Ronald Reagan. His first visit. And that's the first time I got inside the Kremlin, which is really inside the walls. The space inside the walls is very open, very park like, with a lot of old buildings. It's very pretty.